starting secondary school is exciting, but also a little bit scary. And if you have type 1 diabetes, there's more to think about. Hopefully your medical team or parent has spoken with the school and all the other teachers, and they'll be aware of your needs. It can be difficult having to explain things to teachers. Some people carry a card which details everything they need to know. It's important to have your hyperbox prepared and have a second one that the school can hold on to. Some people prefer to carry everything that they need on them so they don't have to leave during class. But if you do leave, it's important to know where the medical room or student services are. If you're missing from the start of the class, it's also useful to find a way of getting the message to the teacher. Basically, you have to find lots of ways to avoid detention. Ignorant people can presume that type 1 is a weakness, but you've already had to learn so much more than most people your age. Every day, you're your own doctor, nurse, dietitian and mathematician. Speaking of ignorance, it's time for some myth-busting. You've got type 1 diabetes from eating too much sugar. Wrong. The cause of type 1 diabetes isn't clear, but it happens when the pancreas stops making insulin. Insulin is the hormone which regulates blood sugar. People with type 1 diabetes can't have any birthday cake. They're not allowed sugar. Wrong. I'm a kid. Sugar is my life. I just need to balance it with insulin. Put that phone away or I will confiscate it. Wrong. That's my meter and I need to know my levels. People with diabetes go invisible for a split second whenever they're testing their levels. This is absolutely true, but it's very quick. Blink and you'll miss it. People with type 1 are made of glass and can't do sports or play like everyone else. Wrong. I can do anything anyone else does. Now, a word to my new friends. I'm not an alien. I'm not contagious. And I'm not diabetes. It's just something I have to deal with. If my blood sugar levels are high or low, it affects my mood and I might go quiet or be a little bit grumpy. Please don't be offended. A word to teachers. I definitely need your help, but I don't need the big diabetes spotlight on me. Also, two words. Time management. I've got a whole separate timetable to deal with. Please help me out. Starting secondary school is a big moment. And everyone, whether they have type 1 or not, is going to be nervous and excited. You'll have some extra stuff to pack, as well as the correct stationery. And you may get some silly questions. It's up to you how much you want to talk about it. Eventually, you'll get used to the new routine and it will become second nature. We all have big moments in our lives. But with a little preparation and courage, we can overcome the challenges and start enjoying the exciting stuff.